We're here in New Orleans visiting with former Ranger Daniel Thomas. Uh, first of all, you know, from Hilliard, Florida originally, how the heck did you get to Senatobia, Mississippi? Um, I don't know, I really don't even know. I know I got a call from uh, Coach Thornton at the time when I was in um, high school. He had seen some film from me. I don't know how he got it out, but, um, you know, it just worked out and I got to Mississippi. You were there in 2006, 2007, uh, J.C. Grid Gridiron, uh, All-American. Yeah. You know, can you just talk about your two years there? You played, you know, running back and quarterback. Yeah. Uh, in high school, the same thing, too. What, do you prefer one over the other? Um, at the time, I didn't. Um, I just wanted the ball in my hand, so it worked out fine. And the coaches let me, you know, run the ball as a running back and a quarterback and use my athleticism, so, I mean, it was a good play for me. You know, you won the division championship in one of your years there. Uh, any funny memories, funny stories from Senatobia, coaches, players, and anything like that? Um, I got a, quite a few. Um, our ex coach Randy Pittman he used to uh, <laughs> drink this energy drink. They used to try to make us drink, and I remember him being on the sideline, like foaming out of him off and drinking <laughs> it. And, uh, that's what I remember like, half of that. So. After Northwest, you went to Kansas State, two big years there. Uh, you didn't qualify right away. Yeah. Had to get your grades up right. You know, there's, there's a lot of kids that come to junior college that, you know, have problems with grades yeah. and stuff like that. They get them right and then right the ship. You're one of those stories, the guy that went back, got your grades, took care of business. Yeah. You know, what do you say to the young guys that, you know, you're a young guy yourself, yeah. but what do you say to those guys 18, 17 years old, how important grades are? Yeah, it really is important. Um, you know, in junior college, you know, there's a lot of distractions. So you got to, you know, you got to run, run with the right crowd. And stay focused, you know, your main goals go there, get your grades and get out. So, I mean, the main thing is just stay focused and dream big. Two big years at Kansas State, rush for over 2,800 yards, 30 touchdowns. You know, how good of a fit was that for you? Yeah, um, it was a really good fit. You know, they played to my strength, you know, they let me play quarterback and, a little bit, and running back, a little bit quarterback. And uh, Coach Snyder is one of the best coaches that were coaching college, so it was a great fit. Uh, you're one of 20 all-time draft picks for Northwest. Uh, you've been in the league now three years. Uh, you know, talk about the daily grind. I mean, how different is the NFL than college? Yeah, I mean, like you said, it's everyday grind. You know, with uh, college, you know, classes and everything. And you know, NFL, it is your job. So, I mean, you just got to stay focused. And, uh, you know, that's the main thing, just staying focused. Uh, growing up in Hilliard, Florida, did, did you have a favorite pro team growing up? <laughs> you know, you're only six hours, I guess, uh, from Miami to Hilliard. You know, how how awesome is that for your family to be so close? And do they do you get they get a chance to come to games yeah. a lot? Yeah, you know, like I said, it's only you know five and a half six hours, so you know they're able to drive up on a weekend and go right back. It's a quick drive. Maybe fly so many hours, so. Uh, you've had to battle hamstring injuries, uh, a couple injuries throughout your career. How healthy are you now, and how much is that, you know, frustrating uh, that you've been battling that? Yeah, it's very frustrating because, you know, when I was in college, I didn't have those nagging injuries. And then when I got here, you know, they kind of caught up with me. And, uh, but as of right now, I feel very uh, last question, you know, despite the loss tonight, what's it like playing on the big stage like this, Monday Night Football, huge crowd, the lights and everything? What just what's it being on this level? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's your dream of, you know, when you look, you know, always, you always had these dreams of playing on this stage, Monday Night Football, and you know, just being in the NFL, it's just a great feeling, especially coming from, you know, Northwest and Well, Daniel, appreciate it, man, uh, you know. All the love back from Senatobia, Mississippi. I appreciate your two years there, and uh, best of luck this season.